So I was going to ask you, what things did you do to help yourself um, better understand how your kids learn and what you need to best teach them? I, I've heard a little bit from you. You know, you've talked to some some experts, but um, what what are some ways that parents are thinking, you know, I don't even know where to start with trying to figure out how my child learns or what they could possibly need that is different from my own learning experience. Well, as far as your own learning experience, politely, who cares about you? Mm -hmm. We're not teaching you. So I might be more comfortable in a classroom, maybe because that's what I'm familiar with. Maybe it's because I like the auditory learning. Mm -hmm. But it's not about me. It's how does your child. So try things. Try. Mm -hmm. Does it work best if I say, you know, here, Peggy, read this. Or Peggy, would we like to talk about this? Or... Mm -hmm. Would you like to watch it? Would you like to do it Mm -hmm. and try it and see what works? And again, talk to other people. Mm -hmm. They can see things sometimes that you can't because you're so close to it. Yes, exactly. And see what they have to say. Mm -hmm. And so there, to me, there's no one right answer that you take a quiz and poof, there's the answer. Because as soon as you do, your kids are going to change. Yeah, that's so true. Yes. Right. Yeah. So we have to keep changing with them. We have to keep checking. So even if you decide, okay, my kid's very hands-on, mm-hmm. they don't like the auditory, right. um, they don't like me talking to them, you know, they want to all figure it out themselves. Okay, that's now, but don't stop the auditory. Right. Don't stop yes, the that's great advice. Don't stop mm-hmm. the, you know, keep going with it because if mm-hmm. you've got a child who's very hands-on, okay, that's great. Mm-hmm. but they still need to learn how to follow directions. Yes. yes. And it may not be mm-hmm. their you know, verbal. It may not be their, their area that they're the strongest, mm-hmm. but sometimes life is verbal. You know, when I listen right. to yeah. you know, in the airport and they say, you know, they make announcements, I need to be able to hear it, translate it, understand and act on it. Right. So it's exactly. not on. Yep. So I think the thing is, is you can't look and say, my child is, X way of learning. Mm -hmm. They may prefer that. They may be more comfortable with it. Mm -hmm. We still have to play with the other types of learning. 